So what we're doing here is we're throwing retrieves uh, to Ike, and I'm shooting the shotgun while I'm doing it. Mango's uh, cruising around, and Tonka, as you see, Tonka is uh, on a leash, and he doesn't have any room to gain uh, forward momentum, and that's what you want. This is uh, really me making sure that I can start shooting the shotgun right over Tonka. At this point, I'm within uh, five feet of Tonka, and we're throwing the retrieves to Ike, and uh, Tonka is more interested in the... Uh, in the retrieving than he is the, the, the shotgun, and that's what we want. We, we want him to not, you know, just look at the shotgun. It's like that's something, it's part of the games that we play, and it's, it's nothing to be afraid of. And right now, I'm ecstatic because it, it you know, my dog is not going to be gun shy at all. And all the work that I've done in the last uh, four months has paid off. We really, I have a rock solid dog. It, it really is impervious to the gunshot. So we're not uh, using heavy loads here. We're shooting light loads. And um, we just keep doing retrieves and getting uh, Tonka used to uh, this game that me and Ike play, which uh, is retrieving with, the, with uh, me shooting the shotgun and then th me throwing the dummy. Now, in a few seconds, uh, you'll see me. I go right over by Tonka, and the reason why I go over by Tonka is I want to be closer, and I also want the shotgun shells, here I go, I want the shotgun shells to eject, and I want them to eject over by Tonka because it is something that I don't want him to uh, be startled about, but um, he has to see this, he has to see this. Now, he just, a shotgun shell just landed right by him, and he really did play, paid it, never no mind, which is good, and so uh, we're doing the same thing over there, but um, you know we're just I'm just shooting a bunch of loads right now, and um, as you see, Tonka is uh, totally chill with this. I really I highly recommend that you uh, train your dogs early on when they're puppies. You work with them and make sure that they don't have any sound phobias. You can make sure by doing this training your dog when it's young that it has no sound phobias. Just follow the steps and take your time. You want to be thorough. Kick ass. See that Tonka?